All right, here we've got one of our converted E46 single xenon projector conversions. Customer did paint everything black. However, we typically leave these original style in chrome and the black mixture. Now, that is the new Micro D2S right on the right hand side. It's the original single xenon on the left hand side. And we'll show you how they stack up against one another later in the video. However, this is the hardware that's required. It comes as the Bosch single xenon retro quick kit along with this Morimoto projector that can be selected. And if you want a non-AR coated, we also have our own version of this projector. The coating is subtle, but you can see it's got a little bit of a purplish, bluish hue. And this is what's going to boost your performance into the modern world, essentially. But you can tell this is obviously blacked out, but you do see the AR coating. Aside from that, it's got the Orion V4 halos that we offer on the website. And we'll show you how this all performs in a moment. All right, now this is the converted micro D2S projector. We're using the Morimoto one in this case. It's got the AR coated lens along with brand new OSRAM laser next gen bulbs. So that's gonna maximize performance on this Bosch single xenon conversion. And that's the original projector up top. It's a single xenon, sort of old school, really one of the original units that was available on the market as far as projectors go. That design had stayed uh, stayed stayed for some time and was used later converted to a bi xenon. But this is a single xenon up top, so you only have low beam, and the micro D2S gives you that high beam performance. Uh, of course, you'd get some better performance with the new bulbs in there, but it'll still be kind of diffused. It's a very tall, kind of European style slope, and you can see that that bulb is pretty shot because it's making the laser, which is pretty warm. Um, look almost like a cool white but it's pale it's pink and the beam pattern is not really too consistent either it's a little spotty and that's how that's how those projectors were but you can see how the hotspot is on the new micro d2s it's really intense right under the cutoff it'll give you really good distance visibility and of course you can see the width has improved just overall a huge improvement and uh that's also with the the projector inside the housing behind the lens, which does rob a little bit of performance as well compared to the single Xenon fully exposed. But let us know what you think, leave a comment below and we'll go from there.